Hello and welcome to Sunday Afternoon Football. Anthony Hudson here live. Gary Lyon is with me today. Welcome, Gaz. Hi, Hutto. Always a pleasure. Well, today it's Carlton versus Collingwood. And here we go, it's Carlton taking on Collingwood. It's cut off by Cripps with the ball now. Grundy, applied physical pressure, the free kick going to Grundy. Tries to gain some territory. Scoops up the ball. Ball up in the centre square. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? This is a great game, Hutto, and we can just sit back and enjoy it. And now... Wins the ruck duel, collects the loose ball. Adams receives the ball. He gains possession. Goes for the goal. He kicks that goal with purpose. Is it true at the line? Why not? Elliot loves that goal. Puts the first goal on the ball. It's great to watch, Hutto. Plenty of excitement. He did really well there. About to resume play. Guides it down. A chance for Goeys. Ball spills. Pitnett throws the ball away. Drives it long. Chris picks up the loose ball. The ball mopped up. Barco kicks hurriedly. It's a foot race to get this one. Found time to get it on the boot. Show something. Go short by hand. The tackle misses completely. Just gets it onto the boot. McKay flew high. Hold on. He wins possession. Avoids the pressure. Beam dishes it off. He can take off after that handball. Good grab there. Ski Seaton. He spears the ball. Can't take possession. We'll get a ball up. Pittman aims for his man on the ground. Free going the way of Adams. Slams it on the boot. Finds the loose ball. Does well to get it out. Sweeping handball for me. Sends it home. That's his first. Majacek celebrating hard. We're back in motion. Thrashes it. Side bottom with the ball. Putting on the boat was Dankos. Puts on a big hit. What can you tell us, Gaz? There's some great skills on display right now. A great match. Collingwood are getting beaten at the coalface. They need to rectify these clearance numbers to give themselves the best chance going forward. He's worked hard and probably needs a chance to rest. Side bottom takes the mark. Uncontested. Drops the ball. Martin on the ball. He gets above the crowd. Keeps the kick low. Spent that one before he earned it. Dacos gets in the way. How? Dug out the loose ball. Put it. 
McKay hurls it away. Lobs the handball. Cox just gets it onto the boot. Finds himself in space and marks. The loose ball picked up. Pittman getting it. Slapped away. Sear curry kick. Myatek had it, lost it, dug it out. Brown flicks it over. Adams just gets it onto the boot. The mark is taken by Elliott. 50 metres out. Move it on. Going for goal number two. Start the kick ball, and it never came. Colin Woodrick, Saad with the responsibility of picking it in. Colin Wood is struggling to maintain the pace of the game. They might need to slow it down and take some uncontested marks to get the game back on their terms. Found a way to keep it alive. Spears the ball. Stuck the mitts out there and held on to it. Puts it on the boot. Takes a simple grab. With a driving kick. Hands it out to open space. Rushes with the kick. Finds a bit of room to mark. Side bottom, just put it on the boot. Marks now and can send it back. Colin Wood haven't been in control. They've given up way too many uncontested marks and are letting the opposition set the pace. And the mark will be paid. Looks up with the kick. Ball spills, squeezes out a handball. Intercepted by McKay. Going for goal number one. Marks now, and can send it back. Slams it on the boot. Ball picked up, licks with hands. Kerner comes it towards goal. It's a poor kick, and it hits the behind post. Hits the point post, it'll be a free. Kicks it out at defence. Kerner doesn't quite with the leap. He's got the footy in his hands. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Keeps the kick low. Rough air marks up contested. Wants to play on. A chance to go to the ball. Martin gives it a run. Ends up turning his ball over. Colin Wood going on the opposition on contested marks, but they sit up on the ball so well it forces the opposition to play that style. Silvani brings the ball in the air. Looks up with the kick. The contest, no match for him. Of course not. Taconic just bangs away at goal. Cards are fans it. getting excited. There's the siren for the end of the quarter. The scores are Collingwood 13 to Carlton 6. Collingwood grew up and about early. Beams on top of the ranking points. He's on fire at the moment. Ready to go for the second turn. Back in the middle to resume play. Winning it was Grundy. Made the tricky bounce look easy. Is in his possession. He's got the football now. Pitnett has a teammate on the move. A long driving kick. Ruffin determined to reach the ball. Marks that ball uncontested. Doing well to intercept that kick. Puts it on the boot. Setterfield missed an opportunity to mark. Collingwood get themselves the free. Chose to kick it. Sees it over the boundary line. We'll get a ball in. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? I'm loving what this game is giving us right now. 
Collingwood trail in the clearance numbers, but it's not a big issue for them because of their defence. Going for goal number one. It's a poor kick, and it hits the behind post. That kick hits the behind post, so it's on the fall. Chris keeping it low. Takes the mark all by himself. Collingwood are allowing too many marks inside the opposition 450. They continue to get beaten in this area. They'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Sinks the slipper into it. An easy grab for Sia. Heads long with that kick. Well taken at ground level. The umpire calls for the ball now. Pittnet thumped it clear. Puts it into space. Might be a bit of an injury for Maine. I think the doctor will be taking a close look at that one. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. Collingwood forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. Does well to cut off the field. Nice mark under pressure. Sharon Burke wants to keep it moving by hand. Slams it under the boot. Maine gets the loose ball. Dug out the loose ball. They can create from this. Got the hands free. Gets a handball away. March back. Goes with the kick. McKay steals possession. Clears the ball from the contest. Kennedy picks it up. This is Mutt. Takes them on. <laughs> Carlton close the gap to Tick. Teammates break for him. Plays onto himself. Moved on by Roughhead. Finds a bit of room to mark. Getting in the way was Nunes. He flicks it over. Hits the target by hand. This could even things up. Open opportunity for side ball. Got boot to ball. They chase after the loose ball. Opportunity for rough hand. He wins possession. Main runs out of the field. Tell us anything at the moment, Gaz. I'm liking what I'm seeing at the moment, Hutto. A great game of football. Pendleton hands it into open space. Walsh wins the ball in the air. Looks to move it by foot. Kerner takes the ball. Goes by foot. It's a foot race to get this one. Penetrating handball. Adams rushes with the kick. McKay gets onto the ball. Sard with a clean collect. Kerno blinks with a teammate who can run. Avoids the tackler. Moves the ball by foot. Couldn't take it. Uses his pace. Puts boot to ball. Kerno couldn't hang on to the ball. Gains some territory. To Connie goes to the man on the run. Thumps it clear. Decides to kick. There's nothing in this. Searching for a teammate. Adams leading the race to the loose ball. Pendlebury coming on. And we'll get a ball up. Pittnet won the hit out. Kerno controlled the difficult ball. They could take the lead here. Kennedy going for number one. To go through from behind. The margin is now under a goal. Judy's. Chris wins the foot race. Quickly onto the boot. Ball off hand. 
gives a down with a driving kick. Finds himself in space and marks. Can't take the mark. Barco just throws it. Only seconds remaining in this quarter. They chase after the loose ball. Cripps lobs the handball. Gets a hand to the ball. Goes off the grip. That's it for the first half. Welcome to tennis, guys. The Magpies have had a solid first half and will look to show more of the same in the second. Let's see what the stats have to show. Collingwood have been inside 50 less times than the opposition, but they're making the most of their chances and that sees them in front. Thanks for that, Gaz. An interesting first half. Let's see how the third quarter pans out when we return from after our halftime break. A big second half about to begin. Back in the middle as the rucks go at it. Thump clear. Majek clean from the half volley. He drives it. A chance to reload the attack. Jones gets the handball away. Plowman hacks it forward. A strong pack move. A stab kick from Beams. Easily takes the mark. Grundy has resources out wide. Sidebottle packing it out of there. May goes it alone. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. We're back in the middle now. Collingwood got behind the clearances, but a set up well enough defensively that hasn't made a big impact. The umpire will ping him for deliberate. Langdon spears the ball. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. You're right, Hutto. He's gone missing lately. Finding the ball with ease. <laughs> Clown and players move as they look to provide an option. Petreski seated, marks uncontested. Elects to kick. McDonald got hands to it. Chris Campbell's to no one in particular. Charges with intent, narrowly avoids the tackle. Finds a target. Moves the ball along the wing. Kennedy marks it. Colin Wolf haven't been able to set up any set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning total that way. Maynard marks in a bit of space. Goes with the kick. Keeps it moving. He has the ball. He goes it alone. the margin. This is how they can score big, Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. Back in the middle now. Punches it clear. Is in his possession. Side bottom drives it out of the pack. A big contested grab. 35 metres out. Going for goal number one. to bring it back into play. Plowman with the mark. Loses it now. Hoskinelli uses the bump with quick hands. Handball's under pressure. He's getting a lot of the ball, Gas. He's everywhere at the moment. Takes the mark all by himself. 45 metres out. Going for goal number one. That came off.
About to resume hostilities. Swanson up for grabs for Adams. Uses it by foot. Gathered by Clowman. The handball now from Marchbank. Hurried kick. Kerno looks to get onto the football. Cleanly picked up. Moves it by foot. Dacos gets in a good position. A chance to put one through here for Collingwood. Now with a low spearing kick. Barco gets on the end of this. The distance might be just beyond him. A 45 degree angle for this shot of goal. He just sets the ball well. Marchbank elects to kick. Langdon scoops it up. Does well to keep it in play. Turned it over. Silvani moves it by hand. Sinks the slipper into it. Side bottom could be upset with that. Walsh selects the loose ball. Dishes it off. He can take off after that handball. Ball collected. Handball's out in front. Here's how. He gets his hands on the footy. Seen plenty of it. Sees it out of play. Thoughts at the moment, Gaz? It's a really good contest out there right now, and it's great to watch. Kicks hurriedly. Dacos takes the mark and contested. Mark and looks to send it back. Goes with the kick. Manufactures the handball. Intercepted. He gains possession. He goes for broke. Oh. Now they lead by 13. Collingwood are costing themselves with turnover today. They need to find a way to control the play better and stop turning it over. Clowman pushes a long ball. McDonald grabs that ball. Slams it on the boot. Williams doesn't take the mark. Fisher picks up the loose ball. Bangs it on the boot now. Beam spills it. He's on fire at the moment, Gaz. He's getting off the chain. Thrashes it. He's got the footy in his hands. Hits the target by hand. Kick by side bottom. Mark by name. Offs to play on. Does well to come off the field. Wall shot the hands free. Just gets it onto the boot. A lot of possessions for him. We head into the final turn with Collingwood 28, playing Carlton 15. Collingwood will want to keep the foot on the accelerator and finish this last quarter strong. What can you tell us from the stats, Gaz? Carlton have been better around the contest, but they need to make the most of that stat and put it on the scoreboard. Thanks. Let's see what this last quarter throws up. Can't afford any mistakes from here. They have to be perfect. Punched away. With the ball now. <laughs> Got the hands free. Applies a bump. Cripps. There to mop up. Hoskinelli having a big game. He's really having a big impact on this game. Coughed up by Walsh. Picked up by Jones. Fins off the tackle. Sarge is streaming past and gets the footy. Martin has had plenty of it, Gaz. He's been superb today, Hello. With a driving kick. He has to hold on to those. Gets it away. Picked up now. Wins the race to the ball. Ball up in the centre square. What can you tell us, Gaz? I'm really enjoying this one, Hutto. Great tackle. Looks like the ball will be coming back. 
Collingwood just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Moves the ball by foot. Couldn't complete the mark. And the umpire says, my ball. Hammers it under pressure, but keeps it alive. And the ball ends up over the line. Ball to be tossed back in. Thrown in now. McKay with the hit. Just got the hands in the back there. Just goes. The kick for Varco. Chris with an easy mark. It's a long kick. See it. Bounce some space and marked. Uses it by foot. Rushes with the kick. Off hands from Petrevsky Seaton. The ball goes to ground. Plowman grabbed it clean. They can link up now. Kerno, is this the moment? Just wasting opportunities in front of goal. Carlton, the margin, back within three goals. It's marked by Mina. Spears the ball. Found space for an easy mark. Elects to kick. Chris collects it. Dishes it off. The ball rolls over the boundary line. Ball back into play. Thump by McKay. Centerfield wax one on the ball. Considering the options on the kick in. The ball ends up here. Collingwood have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. A race for the loose ball. There'll be a ball up close to goal. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? This is a classic game in the scene right now. Umpire ready to resume play. Clears the contest. Cripps uses his pace. Gives the old boat argument. Has it now. Ruffin uses it by foot. See it does well to mark. Kicks along the wing. Couldn't see off Petrovsky Seaton. Outstanding pressure. Looks up with the kick. Great grab. Got the hands free. Oh, he slams it onto the boot. Gets into some space to mark this. Pitton elects to kick. Intercepts the ball very well. Looks to move it by foot. Over the top of the pack. Goes by hand. He's got the football now. A spearing kick. The ball spells to see it. A good job, keeping it in play there. Uses the hands instead of the body, and it's a free kick. Goes by foot. The ball finds itself to the boundary. The ball is coming back into play. Pittenhead thrashes it. Brown kicks hurriedly. The mark has been taken. Players move as they look to provide an option. Good mark and looks to send it back. 50 metres from home. If they just maintain position and hold onto the ball for a moment, they should be able to hold on here. Takes the chance and says, thank you very much with that goal. Barco enjoying that goal. Two goals the margin for the Magpies. It's
Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. Carlton, forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. Wall takes advantage. He wins the ball in the air. He spears the ball. Good mark there. Kick by Marchbank. Got hands to it. Williams with a shorthand pass. Cripps going for number one. It's only the Just Collingwood have actually turned it over more than the opposition, but they haven't allowed that to translate into scores. It's why they're still in front. Sharon Burke kicks it. Takes the mark. Kicks to the square. He just can't get out of the action. Silvani throws the ball away. Dugowie has resources out wide. Colin Wood caught out too many marks inside the opposition 450. They continue to get beaten in this area. They'll find it. Not a great performance. And in the end, it was a poor result for Carlton. Gary, what do you make of the result? Sometimes you're just happy to walk away with the four points. They weren't at their best, but they did what they had to do. Final scores are 35 to 24. Well, that's all we have time for. Thanks for joining us. Thank you, Gaz. It was great being here, Hutto. I can't wait for the next match. Because...